Hey guys, welcome to another Toby Investigates. In this episode, I'm going to be looking at one by drivetrains. So first of all, for all you guys wondering what I'm on about when I'm talking about one by drivetrains, it's probably important that we establish just what one is. So let's head over to the bike, take a look. Okay, so what do I mean when I say a one by drivetrain? Well, it's really quite simple. It has just one chain ring up the front. If I had two, it would be a two by system. And if I had three, it would be a three by system. Now they offer a very wide range when you have a number of cogs to choose from at the front here. So why the sudden increase in popularity of the one by system? Well, it's because now with modern engineering techniques, we can create systems with a very large range on the cassette here. It means the biggest cog here is very big and the smallest is very small. Now there are two other factors that also have contributed to the popularity rise of these and that is the clutch rear mech, this here, having a lot of resistance in it meaning that this chain is kept nice and tight to stop the chain falling off which was always a plague of one by systems of yonder. Also another very small detail is that manufacturing techniques on the chain rings here mean that we can create teeth that are much better at retaining the chain and overall this whole package, the wide range, the, the better retention of the chain has increased their popularity. So let's look at some advantages and some disadvantages of why you might choose this system. Okay, so now we are all clear on what a one by drivetrain exactly is. Let's look at some of the advantages of it. Now, first of all, it is really, really clean looking. You'll see that there's just not much stuff on the bike. It's a pretty simple system as it goes. Now, of course, with this simplicity, you've removed parts from the bike, you've made a weight saving. It is marginal, but it is a weight saving nonetheless. And of course, we're removing parts from your bike. There's less to go wrong and there's less to carry out maintenance on. So overall, it is a simpler system to maintain. Running through the gears, you haven't got so much of a faff thinking about what you're doing with the front versus the rear. It's just a seamless run all the way through your bottom gear to the top gear. And some people may find enjoyment from this, not having to worry about what they're doing with their gears so much. It's much more intuitive just to go up and down the block. So let's think about some disadvantages of a one by group set. Well, really, in my eyes, I can't see too many. However, some could argue that the range, i.e. your highest gear and your lowest gear, the difference between that just cannot be as big as some two by or three by systems. Well, with the emergence of 12 speed, um, SRAM Eagle, for instance, they have very, very wide ranges and will match up to almost any two by system. The three by system is still yet to be matched, but if you're going for that, you're probably going for an entirely different type of riding than a one by setup would go for. Another disadvantage could be considered that one by drive trains have been quite expensive for quite some time. But as technology is trickling down into cheaper options, it's becoming more affordable, more accessible for a wider range of people. So it all comes down to the big question, is a one by drive train the right thing for me? Well, I think a lot of people stand to get some advantages out of this. It makes bike riding simpler, easier, more accessible, and therefore more people are gonna get enjoyment out of it. As I said earlier, it's lighter, it's cleaner, less maintenance, less to go wrong. The advantages seem to heavily outweigh the disadvantages. Anyway, I would love to hear what you guys think about one by systems, what I said in this video. Let me know in the comments section down below, or hit us up on any of our social media. Thank you very much for watching and until the next time, as always, enjoy the ride.